So there's a, a bit of a rule of thumb I try to I try to gauge. So when you're gripping somebody and you have the grip and you can feel that grip all the way up your forearm, <laughs> up your arm, yep. and your shoulder, and your chest, and you're just holding on. Yeah. But you don't you don't need to use any of that. No. Like if you just have the grip, yes. you can you can follow them along. Mm-hmm. Like you can and it's and it's easier because you can react and move with their movement. If you are so locked up on any any yeah. grip, <clears throat> trying to keep them from moving at all, I think that's that's very unnecessary. Well, and it's it's useless for you exactly. realistically. It's um, doing it's doing more harm than good. It really is. It's yeah. gassing you out, and it's also <clears throat> leaving you open to things because you're not going to be able to react to anything they do right. very well because you're yeah. just stiff as a freaking board. It, it does pose problems as far as like if I'm rolling with a a very big strong white belt, <clears throat> Frank. He's and he just blue belt. And he just oh yeah, he's got a blue belt now. He's he's still annoying. He's a baby blue belt, so it doesn't count. Yeah. yeah. So my my point is, they will pose problems. So if yeah. they're if they're holding me down as hard as they can, I'm like, all right, I have to I have to deal with it. Mm-hmm. So it might take more moments in time to get what I want. Yeah. Or I just have to wait until that runs out. Like you have a gas tank, and if you're using your entire gas tank by trying to hold me in one static spot, yeah. you're going to deplete that eventually. Doesn't matter who you are. Right. So you're better off not using that strength and just if you don't have the technique to deal with whatever situation it is, learn what you did wrong. Yeah. So, oh yeah. <clears throat> so what what happens is we we were talking about this before the show is Ego isn't ego isn't the big problem. It's the competition mindset. So that uh, I have to win. So yeah, I so I was talking to somebody. He goes, I don't care if I lose. Honestly, it doesn't bother me. I expect you. So if I'm and coming rolling, from him, I believe him. Yeah, He's so, a super nice dude. Yeah. So I'm rolling with a purple belt. Like I I know that I'm going to win. I know I've rolled yeah. with you enough. You have the technique, and I don't know what I'm doing, and you're mm-hmm. going to win. And, and he goes, I understand when you're saying, don't do this. Roll like this. And, I'm, yeah. and mentally, I'm like, I get it. I can logically go, I, I get that. But I get in these positions where, I, where I'm where i like, well, I don't... Don't I know don't, what to do. Yeah, exactly. So I don't have any yeah. other answer other than hold and grab hold and, just, or, and just use... Hold or extend away. Those <clears throat> right. are the two that you... Yeah. Just, it's natural. It's like, yep. okay, you're too close to me. I need to get away. What yep. do I do? I push. Yep. And it's, it's kind of ingrained in a lot of us where we, you know... You grow up, you're in all the sports, you know, football and baseball yep. and basketball, and it's, hey, it's competition, it's winning. We like to win. You play yep. chess, you do whatever, I like to win. You grow up in the military, <laughs> we want to win. It's, yes. Everything's about winning. And it's not ego so much, it's just that competition mindset. You're in mm-hmm. business, you want to win. Everything's a competition. So when you're rolling, it just kind of like clicks in. You're not, so when we say ego, usually people think asshole. It's like, it's almost like an equivalent. Yeah. Like, he has a huge ego. ego. Uh, yeah. You might as well say he's a huge asshole. You might as well, yes. And that's not what we're talking about. We're talking no. about the competition. So when he's saying, <clears throat> in the heat of the moment, I I find myself ratcheting up the strength. Mm-hmm. Like, well, I can stop you from doing what you want to do if I just use more lat. Like, I just yeah. really exactly. cinch down on yep. that. And then if you move more, I'll just cinch down more. And with that... What that looks like is two people going like this, and they're just stuck. Well, it's two rams locked in horns yeah. doing nothing. So, uh, conversely, like if you're if you if you have somebody mounted mm-hmm. and they're and they're doing you know the static, they're just yep. holding right. Holding they're, their, they're, hold, yeah, just yep. holding their collars. <clears throat> well, if if I had the strength to just go, mm, that's adorable, and push and your, push your arm hands down. up, yeah, or push their arms up into their throat, yeah, yeah, it happens. Or you know, some people can just like you know, grab your head and just pull up and yep. you know, their knees slide under your elbows. And if you had the strength to do that, I would I would argue that that's good technique. You're getting yourself in a position and they can't stop you. Well, and they're doing anti-jujitsu. <clears throat> right. Because they're not using a technique to get out or forward their position or incorrect their position. Exactly. They're literally holding a shit position. Exactly. <laughs> so, so if you're using technique defense and technique, if you're using strength defensively, to hold them, to keep them from doing something, you're you're just delaying the inevitable. Yeah, you're so, not, and, and you're not learning anything. Yeah, exactly, you're yeah. just not getting anything out of that role. Right. Yeah, because you're, and it happens a lot. Yeah, a lot. Anti jujitsu is a really big thing, and it comes from ego. Yeah. And guess what? It doesn't matter if you're man, woman, child. You do it. Right. Like it's just natural. It's a natural. Yeah. 
don't know, is it f- fight or flight? I don't yeah. know, but it's well, a so, thing of so it's 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 it can be ego or asshole. I can't be yep. just super competitive. I can't help myself. It's just ingrained in me. It can be fight or flight. It can yep. be fear. So it can be a lot of different reasons why you're doing yeah, this. But I'm just saying with ego, <clears throat> it's uh, not the asshole ego. It's the I I I want to win. Yeah. And it doesn't make you an asshole because you so want to win. Yeah, but it does give you an yeah. ego because you think yeah. you can win yeah. by doing anti jujitsu right. and just holding that you can't. Yeah. So if I would rather I would rather have somebody tap out far more by going, okay, if I if I'm mounted and I just hold on like this and not move and use all my strength, mm-hmm. well you're not you know, okay, you're 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 not tapping out, you're winning. Okay, yeah. I get it. But if we're just rolling and we're using this role to learn about jujitsu, I'd rather see you, okay, place your frame down here, you know, yeah. y- use the one escape that you've learned. Try it. If, even if, it if you doesn't do it wrong, work, who cares? Right. And you're it, gonna it, learn from that more than you're gonna right. learn holding on to your collars. Right. No! <laughs> so so if a white belt tries the basic uh elbow knee push right you just yeah. just base, yep. basic level one or trap and roll whatever yep. they learn first the upper belt knows what you're doing and they're going to defeat that mm-hmm. so as a white belt you feel defeated you know like in a greater sense yeah so then you just start throwing crap at the wall to see yeah. what strings yep. well sticks well then you're you're teaching yourself bad habits and you're yeah. not, you're not helping. You're, you're not, yeah, no, I would, <clears throat> I would rather have you go, okay, what, what did I do wrong there? What should I have I done? Yeah. Well, you use it as a learning experience rather yeah. than just trying to fight to the death. doesn't help. It doesn't. It really doesn't. It really doesn't help. So, we all go through that phase <clears throat> though. It's, it's, it's yeah. hard to, because yep. you're like, well, I watch other <clears throat> people doing it and it looks like what they're doing. Mm-hmm. You're like, it looks like they're fighting for their lives. And once you get into that level, you're like, oh, no, they weren't. Mm. <laughs> they're having fun. Yeah. <laughs> but in your eyes, it's like they're trying to murder. That's what they're going to do to me. I have to yeah. do something to stop that. Right. Right. 